Hey y'all, it's your girl Scent and Calliope, aka Kai P. That's my girl. So anyway, we're gonna take her on her um her adventure time slash bathroom break. See where she gonna take us today. If you wanna know how to own it, watch a cloud piece. She own it. She own it. She owns it. Okay. She let you know where she gonna look. We going backwards now. This is what I'm saying, y'all. This is what I'm saying. I don't know where she gonna take me. Look. And I be going back the other way. Now we going this way. What is really going on today? Kali up You hit a bird? You hit a bird, mama? They riding the bicycles today, Clyde PC. They all riding the bicycle today. Let's see if I can do a, a... Everybody's riding the bicycle. Must be nice. It's too hot, though. Okay, little lady, come on, let's go. I was standing in one place. This is Adventure Time with Clyde P. Not standing in one place with Clyde P. Clyde P. Look at her. Like, where is she going now, boy? She can move. Go, Clyde P. Go. Go, Clyde P. Go. Go, go, go. Go, 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 go. go. Look at her go. Look at her go. Look at her go, y'all. It's all on you, girl. Get us some entertainment here. Boring us to death. It's all on you, Calliope. Peepers. My oldest daughter called her Peepers. What do what Joey call her? Oh, I think Kalia Pippa. Kalia Pippa. Yeah. And I call her Kai Kapi. But as you can tell, she don't pay no attention to me. Kai She do her own thing. She be like, look, it's, this is what it is, okay? Take it or leave it. She just, she embodies like all of our personalities whole thing. This one that she might be a little confused. Oh, 
you know, you know it now. They got some, that Fe FedEx, FedEx got some uh, mail for you. Huh? They forgot to drop your mail off. Mm-mm-mm. She's smelling flowers, y'all. Let me show you the flowers she is smelling. See them flowers there? She's smelling the flower, mama. That way she's making flowers. That was smelling those flowers. Look, now she knows it to the other people, the neighbors over there. She goes, nosy. Look, say, who is that? Y'all, I need to start doing some more walking outside so I can deep breathe, deep, uh, deep, uh, breathe deep, you know, get that fresh air in my lungs. Just make your body feel good, you know. Now she turned it around and went the other way. I don't know. I don't know. I mean, these plants are like gorgeous. Look at that, y'all. I feel like I'm in the in the tropical forest or something like that. Look at that. That is so beautiful. Oh my goodness! And then when Calliope in the middle of it, it makes it even more beautiful. She's a pretty dog. Hey, the pretty dog, Mama. She got to be smelling, just sniffing it. I like the way she explored over her. She went on the other side, other sidewalk. Oh, she's off and running, guys. She's off and running. Where's she going? Nobody knows. Where's she going? Now she knows me looking at the car. Listen to the birds. You hear that bird, Calliope? You hear the bird? Yeah. Yeah, you hear the bird. Here come the mailman. You hear the mailman? The mail lady? You hear the mail lady? I think she was trying to find somewhere to go to the bathroom and go see what she does. She always get in front of these people. It's not in their yard, but she be want to just use the bathroom in front of people's house. I don't like that. Because I don't want nobody saying nothing to my dog now. So that's why we try to be respectful. Because I'm particular about people saying different things to my dog and my kids. Because I feel like I, 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 you know, make sure that they do the right thing themselves, myself. You know what I mean? So she's using the bathroom right now. That's why I kind of turned away. So I make sure that, you know, they do the right thing. So I feel like I don't need nobody else to tell them to do the right thing. Because I make sure that they do the right thing. I think she kind of changed her mind. She's so particular. See, I'm particular when I go to the bathroom, my guys. And she holding it. You can tell she holding it. She's like, I'm going to go over here and this little field over here. Come on, don't sniff that. I don't know what that is. That's somebody's white. Now she usually go right here, guys, but I'm not sure. Trying to find somewhere to go to the bathroom, man. Oh, 
hope she don't stand us in the sun while she go. Oof. This Florida heat is a trip. So anyway, the things that we uh, talk about the heat and trying to find something inside opposed to outside. If it's not so hot, you can find a lot to do outside because you can go to the Sebastian Inlet. And then, um, um, which is, you go fishing there, they have a swimming hole, they have the south and the, the, south and the north city. Then you have Wickham Park, you can go to Wickham Park. And they have like a, it, it used to be a swimming hole, but people don't swim in there anymore because the water... I don't know. It's just people started getting the the amoebas in their nose from you know the water not recycling, so it's not fresh enough. Uh, uh-uh, Clyde, like that's the ant bed. Come on. And then um, but anyway, you can go out there. You can um, you can do cookouts if you want to. Look at the little dog. Little dog barking for you, Clyde. P. She said, "I gotta go to the bathroom. I ain't studying that." So, but yeah, and you can go have a cookout, you know, have a little picnic, which I'm not picnic, but you know, they have picnic tables there. So you can, um, so you can, um, you know, spend time with your family or whatever. So, um, but yeah, and then what else we have that's outside? Of course, you can go to the beach. The beach is always nice. You know, you take and you get your um, chair, your beach chair your, with your umbrella or whatever. And usually, even if it's hot, you can go on the beach, you know, because you can get in the water and cool off. You could do that. And what else? Oh, they have a, a trail. What do you call that trail? Um, what is it? It's a, it's a, it's a trail that you can go on here. And, um, and, um, it's like a, like, like a, um, a nature trail. I'm trying to think of the name of it. But we have different ones, and then you can go, um, you know how they have these nurseries and stuff? You can go and um, look at the plants, and they have like a, a nice, like, it's big. You see the, you know, different plants and stuff, and they got it set up like, you know, they have like a setup, which is really nice. So you can go through there and enjoy that. And they have all, all kind of different exotic, and we have different ones, so you have to look for them. Look in the yellow pages or whatever. Or, that, or um, Facebook and different places like that. But they don't have any. Oh, and then for for inside stuff, we got the bowling alley, the skating ring. Um, we have um the movies, of course. You go to the mall. We have Andretti. Um, for kids, you have the different community centers like that. But it's not, it's not like a whole lot that you can, like, really do here. So what we normally do, we'll um, go to Orlando, Florida, which they have, like, tons of stuff. Of course, you know, it's Disney World, and then, um, they have different, um, like, if you like the club scene, they have different clubs, um, not different restaurants, like, I like, I love Bahama Breeze. I like going to Bahama Breeze, and they, that is an a hip, excellent restaurant. So, if you guys get a chance to go to Orlando, I don't know if you have one in your area, but Bahama Breeze is amazing. And then they have the Ripley, believe it, believe it or not, um, I'm going to just call it a center, because I, I don't know exactly. But yeah, and that was nice. We we enjoyed that. That was really really nice. Oh, then we have the flea market, which I think the flea market is not what it used to be. 
Because they, 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 you don't, when you go there, it's not a whole bunch of quality stuff. And then some of the stuff been sitting there for so long and you buy it and they don't tell you that, you know, oh, this is, you know. Because I bought a dress one time. And you know how they have that scrunchy, scrunchy material, um, like a sundress, and you had that scrunchy, scrunchy material up top. And I put it on, and when I put it on, the rubber in that just started um, breaking. So I'm like, gosh. I mean, it wasn't like a whole lot, but I, I, I worked for my money. So I was like, you know what? I work for this money, and if, I, if I'm buying something, I want to at least uh, get my money's worth out of it. Because I'm really particular about spending my money and where my money goes. So I don't waste it. But yeah. I'm trying to think of somewhere else. And everybody loves to go to Walmart. Hang out. I don't, I don't know why. And like I said, I, I, I feel that way because I work at, at Walmart. So I'm, I ain't trying to go hang out. But, you know, you have a lot of people that they bring their kids, they drop them off into the toy department, let them destroy that. I don't know how it go. And then they do their shopping because it's like one-stop shopping. So they do all their shopping. If they need um, lenses, you know, glasses, they do that. If they need a pharmaceutical, a pharmacy, they do that. Um, if they need, um, what else? Oh, they have a bank in some of them. They have a... a, a McDonald's and some it's a Magnolia and some of them. Then they have um I said the eyeglass place. I said the pharmacy. Oh, yeah, you get your nails done. Um and it, and one the one by my house have like a Claire, you know the jewelry and stuff. Claire's. So that was that was um I thought that was a nice little touch. Because then you don't have to go all the way to the mall if you're trying to just get something to match up with an outfit. Look at that. That's so pretty. That is seen right there. Oh, yeah. Look. So pretty. I just love nature. Love nature. So, anyway. Um... else oh then you have sam's but of course you have to have a sam's card but you can go sit in there you can have lunch if you want to after you get done with your shopping or before you start shopping and i would say before you start shopping because then you can walk off whatever you ate to do your shopping but yeah it's a nice area in the um the lunch in there is like really is some um, really um, inexpensive. So come on, clappy. So um, so you're not having to feel like you're gonna spend a whole bunch and then not be able to um, be able to get your purchases that you want that again. Come on, he he ain't out there today. We'll see. We'll see. Um. She's looking for her doggy friend that comes and her. But I'm like afraid if you hit the gate, it's going to be all right. And I don't know how he'll react if he's able to get out and actually come up here where she is. So we don't want that. But then it has to be some throwdown with me, him, and Kalai because I ain't going to let eat the dog. Y'all can judge if you want to judge. But um, I might get ate up, but Kalai, he's going to come out unscathed. Cause that's my baby. Come on, get out, people, y'all. So, but yeah. Um, but yeah, I mean, we can if we look for some things to do here, we can do some. You know what I mean? If we just really be like bored out of our school, we can do it. But like, if you like really want to go and um, really enjoy, cause they know like restaurants, like resorts. In my eyes, there ain't no resorts here that you can go to and be like, okay, I'm going to go to the resort. They have uh, restaurants online, um, convenience store, I mean online, on on ground. Um, and um, they have the pool, and they have uh, bowling, not bowling, but um, you 
can go on the golf court or whatever like that. Okay. And then um you can go on the golf court, but um Don't smell it. Don't smell it. Come on. That was you from the other day, I'm thinking. Why? Why are you smelling bum 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 on the ground? Don't smell bum bum on the ground. So but yeah, so um but yeah, we um we enjoy ourselves when we have to find somewhere. And it's you know, and it's all about who you with to, you know, um whether or not you make it fun. Cause shoot, you can go like to the park and let the kids play. And if you're having a good conversation with somebody that you really enjoy being around, you know, that's that's a great time. I think. See now she got us in this here heat, y'all. That was in the song. Really, Calliope? Come on. I can't stand in the sun. Mama can't. Mama can't stand in the sun. Okay. Well, I've had five, five hydrant, y'all. Remember? Clyde P in the fire hydrant. Say hello, fire hydrant. Say, how are you today? So we greet the fire hydrant, huh, Clyde P? Okay, so her tongue hanging out. So that's my cue to go ahead and, and, and turn her around. Come on, let's go home. You ready? Yes, go home, mama. Let's go home. Mm -mm. She done turn back around, y'all. I'm just trying to help you out, little girl. I'm just trying to help you out, little girl. But, yeah, so, um, it be snakes over there. I, I see snakes all the time. You see the bushes right there? Beyond that, that little guard. Snakes be right up in there, and that's exactly where she go, like, every time. I don't know why. But that is crazy. And at nighttime, when you're walking out here, snakes be just crawling all on the side. Walk. I remember the first time I saw that, I was like, oh, a snake! But, yeah, so... It's tough to do here, especially if you, you know, you never seen the beach. That's going to be amazing to you because you're going to go out there. I remember the first time I ever saw the beach. I mean, it just pulled me in. It was so amazing. I just felt like I felt so free, you know, because you see the magnificence of and the amazingness of God. You know, like, that let you know that God exists. He's real. Because, I mean, how could that be? How could be? How could that happen? How can water go so far and stop? Why, why don't it just keep going? Come on, Clappy, you up here jumping. Like, we ain't trying to do no snake today, little girl. Come on. Look, she thinks she owns me. Y'all, help me out. Help. Help Clyde be taking me out. Help. She thinks she owned me. I'm telling you. What is going on? But yeah, so, so, yeah. It's like that's that song that's what I'm saying. You know, there is a God. Because how, how can water go so far and stop? Somebody's controlling, something's controlling it, right? What she looking at now? What she looking at now? What she looking at now? We going? Are oh, you waiting on me? I'm waiting on you, Kalaki. This is getting down to borderline ridiculous. See all the stuff we get to enjoy, y'all? This is beautiful. Only in Florida. I'm sure it's other places that it's probably much more beautiful than this, but this is what we enjoy. Hey, hey! This is what we enjoy. Right, Clarpy? 
Pete. Pete. We need to go home, little girl. I got things to do. Boo boo. I got things to do, boo boo. Class, Clyde P said, I'm doing me, boo boo. I'm doing me. She love the outside. Y'all see her, right? She loving the outside. chicken and your uh, church's chicken and your Popeye's chicken and, you know we ain't no tight tight small town but we you know we ain't no Orlando either so but we I mean hey if we, we enjoy it because the uh, the driving's easier because like in Orlando I mean it's almost like you're trying to they trying to turn it to uh, New York with the driving but oh god forbid Cause New York driving is crazy, crazy. Maybe I show y'all some videos of me in in New York and how we um how I, how I enjoyed um you know going to New York. I was taking pictures and looking like a tourist, and uh, you know because um my guy he's from New York so. He's like, you know, maybe you don't want to do that because you start to look like a tourist and people take advantage. <laughs> oh my goodness, it was so crazy. Well, actually, um, I took pictures with these, um, you know, these, you know, how they had any costumes on and stuff, and um, they was taking pictures, and I, I'm like, oh, this is so nice. Oh, that's so nice, right? And then after they got through taking pictures, they was like, twenty dollars, please. I said, they got me. I said, I got the all around New York experience, right? Because that was my first time going, and I'm like, I got the all around New York experience, you know. And you know, which of course you don't want nobody to take advantage of. But I'm like, I'm a, I'm a true New Yorker now. I got scammed. So, but it was it was nice though, um, going to New York because that's my my dream um, city. I've, as a little girl, I, I've always wanted to uh, go there. So maybe I, I end up posting some of that so you guys can see it. Come on, Clyde P. We're going to go to the house. Now, Mama, you control. Okay? Now, come on. No, no, no. Mama, you control now. We got to get up out of here. Clyde P. Come on. Look, she don't want to go. She's trying to go by the little way. I, I don't think so. Uh -uh. Oh, look, 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 y'all. <laughs> She's such a brat. Clive P, why you taking me to the opposite direction? I want to go home. I want to go home. Please, I want to go home. Please, Clive P. Please, Clive P. I want to go home. Look at her. I mean, she loves it. See, we can, you know, you, we can learn a lot from animals, you know what I mean? Um, how, you know, just how to enjoy life. Like, if I take this leash off of her, she will have her the most amazing time. Which, I, I can't wait until I'm able to get a fence so she can just run like crazy. You know, of course, I'm looking, and you know, I'm watching her because I want a hawk to pick her up and take her away. Because that they scared me to death about that one. I'm like, oh my goodness, they'll do what? I can't imagine her being in the hand of a um a hawk and just um being hurt. That would destroy me forever. I remember one time a um a raccoon when she was a little puppy. A raccoon came in the yard 
And she looked at the raccoon and she's getting ready to run up to the raccoon. Y'all, I screamed as if I was in a horror movie. I said, ah, ah. and um, she did. She stopped every time I was screaming. She was stop because I know if she'd have ran up on that raccoon, it'd have been a wrap. Puppy or no, raccoons don't care. They they will fight. They will fight a human. They will make a human back down. So I was like, I don't know. And so I had just got out of the hospital because I, I was having some issues, you know, with my, my, um, my heart uh, rate going up. And um, they was like, Mama, get in the house. We got her. But every time I tried to go in the house, I couldn't because I could just, you know, my imagination goes crazy. I just, I just could imagine, you know, the red food just hurting her up. So I was like, oh my God. So I couldn't. <laughs> and my friend, he was, he was like, well, my fiance, he was there. He was like, get in the house. I, we got her. We got her. But that's my baby, y'all. This is my baby. I will fight y'all for her. Y'all can get it for her, okay? Y'all can get it. Nobody gonna hurt her. Say, say I get chastised or whatever, but say my mama love me. She tell me no and stop and don't. No, no, Clyde or whatever, but when she outside, I kind of just let her have her way because, um, so I'm gonna go ahead on it and we're gonna turn this off so I can get on back to the house. But I let her have her way because she, you know, she's on a leash and and I don't have a, I don't have a fence in yard, so, um, so I just try to just let her just, just have at it, you know. So anyway, thank you guys so much for walking with us. Clyde P got a smell the bag. But yeah, we appreciate you guys walking with us and, and spending time with us. And we love you guys so much. From the bottom of our heart, we love you. And we thank you guys for subscribing with us. That is appreciated. Um, it's not taken lightly. Um, it's not taken lightly at all. We just appreciate that so much. You know? Because, um... We will be talking to thin air if you guys wouldn't subscribe to us and looking at our video. And besides all of that, we just, we, I, me, myself personally, I love people. I love loving on people. Um, I love to connect with people who need people. I like connecting with people who don't need people and love helping people. So, it's just, it's all about connecting one with another, you know, and being of service, and and it makes you feel amazing to be of service, service to somebody that needs help, you know, or, or to somebody that's helping somebody else in the world. Let me let, see if I can let y'all see this bee on this flower. You can see the bee on the flower. She, she the bee, guys. Yeah. See, he doing his job. He doing his part. Now we got to do our part as being good neighbors. Do, being good neighbors. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and go. Don't forget to uh, like, comment, and um, subscribe. Um, Comment down below and share with your family and your friend. Let them know what your girl Sid is doing. Cause we having a good time over here. We walking dogs, loving on people, being loving, loving and kind to people, trying to make a difference in the world. Right, Calliope? So anyway, thank you so much. Bye. Bye. Mm -hmm. Love you guys so much. Bye.